Good Saturday evening to you. Chief Meteorologist Richard Scott. Here's your forecast update. After the flooding rains over the past several days, finally catching a break at least this evening across most of Alabama. Conditions have gone dry. Still very humid, though, and that tropical air mass will give us some trouble a little later on as we go towards Monday. Uh, first off, let's go into the day on Sunday. Here's 3 o'clock tomorrow. Notice here. We don't have much rain. I can't rule out a shower or two during the day. The risk of rain is about a 20 to 30 percent on Sunday. Sunday night clouds really thicken back up ahead of a cold front. A good chance for rain and storms moves in late Sunday night and early on Monday. We're talking about some of those storms becoming strong potential for a few severe storms. We're talking about a damaging straight line winds, an isolated tornado or two. That'll be Monday morning into the midday hours after lunch. Uh, the cold front sweeps off towards the east. Behind that, uh, we get a cooler by Monday night and into the day on Tuesday. The front buckles back to the north just a touch as we go to Tuesday night, Wednesday, and more rain moves in. At that point, I don't expect severe weather, but rain will become likely. I think it's going to the day on Wednesday. Forecast tonight, overnight lows back in the 60s. Very warm for this time of year at night. Uh, tomorrow, we'll top out in the mid to upper 70s. Record breaking highs likely tomorrow. Also mostly cloudy and again a small chance for a shower too for our Sunday. Monday, good chance for rain and thunderstorms. Some of those could be strong potential for a few severe storms early in the day. As we go into the day on Tuesday, temperatures will be a bit cooler. We'll top out near 60 on Tuesday. More rain and yeah, there could be some thunder involved on Wednesday. But notice the cooling trend as we go towards the weekend by Friday and Saturday. Some areas could be in the 40s all day starting off the weekend. Overnight lows back in the 30s.